What's up guys, Mike the Cody here. Today we are going to go over the contest that just ended um, seven minutes ago. So yeah, let's just go over the first problem. Uh, I'll just go over the problems I solved and there'll be like two different videos, all right? I only solved two problems this contest. Normally I could, so like, uh, I'll try to solve three next time, but like, I just couldn't, the second problem just took a long time for me to solve. But yeah, I'll get faster at this though. All right, <laughs> the first problem is calculate digit sum of a string. So you're given a string S that contains digits and then an integer K. So what we're trying to do is we're going to like split it into like consecutive groups of size K and so on and so forth. Um, if it's smaller than K, then we stop. Okay. So like if, so let's say we had, uh, let's just go over the example. So here we have, oh my gosh. Yeah. So here we have one, one, Okay, you know what, I'll just copy this. Uh, I'm not I'm not typing this out. This is like a pain in the butt. Okay, so let's just copy this. Why is this not? Come on. Come on. <laughs> okay, okay. So yeah, so so we have in the example we have this, right? One, 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 two, 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 three. So they want us to split S into like consecutive groups of size K. So in the first example, it's like three. So we're gonna split this into three. So, oh my gosh. So there's here, right? Size three. So one on one is one size. Um, one on one two is another size. Two 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 is another size of three. And then two three, we don't have any more sizes, right? It's smaller than three. So it's just two three. And then um, for each group, we're gonna just sum all the digits. So this this group of one plus one plus one would be three this group of one plus one plus two would be uh four uh two plus two plus two would be six and then two plus three would be five okay and then um they want us to merge these together to form a new string so then three four six five would be another string so this would become three four six five right and uh we just repeat this okay uh, keep going, do uh, keep doing this until we get um, until our length of our s is like less than or equal to k. So in our case, uh, we're just gonna keep doing this again until our length is less than or equal to three. So we have three, four, six, and five. So let's just split this by three again. So then we get um, thirteen. Right, three plus four plus six would be thirteen, and then we have five, and then that becomes our new string. So we have one, three, five, and then because it's a uh, size of three, okay, uh, we just ended there. So it, we output one, three, five. So how do you do this problem? Um, the simple gist of it is like you start at zero and then um, we're just gonna like substring of size K every time. And then we're gonna like increment our index by K. So here we start at zero and we're gonna substring to like Three, uh, three digits to the right. So then we have one, one, one. And then we're, if we start at our index i equals to zero, we're gonna add by k. So then zero plus three would be here, right? It would be here at this index. So this would be three. And then we plus three again would be like six here. And then plus three again would be one, two, three, four, five, six, uh, nine here, right? So like just each, every time we're just gonna keep like substringing of size K. So it would be three. And then we just add by three to the index to go to the next uh, number to substring by. And we keep doing that. Then um, every time we substring, we're just gonna sum up all the digits. So to do that, you just convert it into like the equivalent number. So like create like a new variable and then just like add up the digits so what I do here is I just like loop through like each of these individual strings. So we have one, 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 and then I just loop through and convert each character to like its corresponding digit. So one would become one and I just add up all the digits, one plus one plus one, which gives me three. And then um, I also have like another string that I build up on the new string. So that'll be, and in the end, uh, we append each of these, the sums of each of these, the three, four, six, five into a new string. And we set that equal to our, our string S is going to equal to that. And we're going to just keep 
looping through it over and over again until we get uh, s's length is less than or equal to k. Okay? So yeah, that's all we have to do. So that's basically just the algorithm. Uh, I'll just show you what I did. This one actually took me like a few minutes. Surprisingly, AC didn't one go. Um, let me just show you guys the code now because this algo is not that hard. Um, where did I, where's my submissions? Oh, this one, yeah. Okay, so, yeah. So while s.size is greater than k, this is a condition that we're gonna keep do going over and over again. So we're gonna just keep um, keep doing this algorithm of splitting between size k's over and over again until our our string is uh, less than or equal to k, right? So we're gonna repeat this so we have this while loop s dot size is greater than k. Um, we're we're gonna have a new string that we're gonna build up. I call it new string because it's a new string. And then I just have a for loop. Uh, this for loop is just gonna go through every uh, substring of size k. So this is gonna go from here, substring this, then it's gonna substring this, and it's gonna substring this, and then this. Okay, so I add by k every time. So yeah, so this i plus equals to k every time. Um, yeah, and then here is a substring, string v is gonna to equal to s dot substring i k. In C++, the, the first value of substring is like your starting index. But the second, the second like input that you're putting to substring is like the length of the characters that you're going to. So that's what I like about C++ because in this case, I just have to substring from like, start from I zero and then say, I'm gonna substring three characters. So it'll give me length of K of three characters afterwards. So it'll give me one on one one. So that's a good part about this. I just have substring by K. Um, I know in like Java, or like, I don't even know, I think Python, I'm not sure about Python. I know about Java is that you have to actually specify like your ending index. And that's kind of annoying here because like uh, you would have to do like K minus I plus one or something. That would be like your ending index. But this is good because in C++ you could just do this and they'll give you like one, one, one. Okay, then I have my variable sum. And then here I'm just gonna loop through my small substring group, so 1011 is my first substring group. And I'm just gonna convert each character of V of my small group into its corresponding number. So here, 1111 would be like, this one would be become the actual number one. This would become an actual number one, and this would become an actual number one. So this just converts it to like its corresponding digit, right? Each of the characters into a corresponding digit. And I just add, add it up. So then this sums up all the digits in each of the small groups. And then, um, yeah, I convert it to a two string, my new sum, and then I just append it at the end of my new string. So in the end, after we go through all these groups, it'll be like um, three, four, six, five, right? It'll be three, four, six, five. And then, yeah, then, then I set S is equal to that because that'll be our new string. And then we repeat this until, um, our size of our s is less than or equal to k, right? Because if while it's greater than k, it's gonna keep doing this and reduce its size. And at the end, the size of s will be less than or equal to k. And then we just return it. So yeah, that's the gist of this problem. Um, it's not really that hard. Yeah, <laughs> like this is, this is an easy problem. Uh, I think I did it in like 10 minutes or something. So yeah, that's pretty, that's pretty fast. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Rate, comment, subscribe. I'll upload another video because yesterday I didn't upload one. But yeah, I'll upload another video for the next problem. But yeah, peace.